This video is about using double integration to find the average value of a function. The average value of f over region r is 1 divided by the area of r times the double integral over r of f dA. The double integral over region r of f dA is the volume of the function over the region r, and so essentially what we're saying is that the average value equals volume over area. And that makes sense. If we do volume divided by area, we get height, and the function f is the height. Example. Find the average value of f of xy equals xy over the quarter circle x squared plus y squared is less than or equal to 1 in the first quadrant. So we know the first quadrant is the only quadrant we're interested in, and that's where x and y are both greater than or equal to 0. So I sketch my quarter circle centered at the origin, radius 1, and that's going to be my region R. So what I want is I want the area of R and then the volume of F over R. So the area of R, the easiest way to find that is just using geometry. If I were not able to use geometry, I could use a double integral as I did in previous videos. But using geometry, it's a quarter circle, so it's going to be one-fourth pi times one squared. So one-fourth pi r squared gives me pi over four. So that's the area of my region. Now I want to find the volume of f over r. Now I know r can be expressed as the integral from zero to one times the integral or of the integral from zero to square root of one minus x squared. That establishes my quarter circle of xy, the given function, dy dx. So that's going to be my volume of um, f over the region r. So I integrate first the inner integral with respect to y. So the x is like a constant multiple. The integral of y is going to be y squared over 2. So I have the integral from 0 to 1 of x times y squared over 2 evaluated from y equals 0 to y equals square root of 1 minus x squared. And then that dx from the outer integral is still there because I haven't done anything with it. So I plug in my upper bound y equals 1 minus x squared underneath a square root minus my lower bound um, y equals 0 plugged in and I get the integral of x times 1 minus x squared over 2 dx. So when I plugged in the y equals square root of 1 minus x squared the y squared um, part canceled out the square root. If I pull out the 1 half and distribute the x, I get 1 half integral from 0 to 1 of x minus x cubed dx. And I integrate, I get 1 half times x squared over 2 minus x to the fourth over 4 evaluated from 0 to 1 which is 1 eighth. Now the average value of f, f av, equals volume divided by area. So I'm going to do 1 eighth divided by pi over 4. Remember dividing by a fraction is the same as multiplying by the reciprocal. So this is 1 eighth times 4 over pi. And that simplifies to 1 over 2 pi. So we've established that the average value of the function z equals xy over the quarter circle x squared plus y squared is less than or equal to 1 in the first quadrant is 
1 over 2 pi. So in other words, that's the average height of my function f.